it's time for us to create a new user so this is our clients company we want to be able to give access to our clients so he can use this so he can log in to app.ashaseep.com and he can see all sorts of stuff he can see his leads coming in he can chat with his leads he can see how many leads converted how many we lost and all sorts of stuff so for that we'll go to settings we will go to my stuff so my staff in, in in this section we will create a new employee user info so this will be the client's name John Doe in this case because we're just using a test example not does sorry um, John at extra awesome roofing phone number not necessary for now but we need to give him a password let's do this and da, 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 da. user permissions so this this is a feature which allows you to hide certain features and functionalities from the dashboard if you want your client to see uh, the dashboard stats just keep it on and if you just uh, for example let's say we we don't want our clients to see the workflows that we created for him so just simply turn it off we don't want him to use the social planners. We don't want him to use um, uh, maybe triggers. We don't want him to use uh, maybe online listings. So yeah, you can just play around with it to see which or uh, which which features you want your clients to be able to uh, to use. So uh, if you go to user roles, that's fine. The client will be a user, not an admin. Admin are your team members not your clients call and voicemail settings leave it for now availability just play around with it when is the client available maybe monday tuesday wednesday thursday and friday calendar he can connect it by himself so saving it okay so the new user has been created for extra awesome roofing sub account